Welcome to the VDCI CAD Teacher Workshop, Fusion 360 Design 1. In this workshop, we will look at sketch-based solid modeling in the model workspace and T-spline modeling in the sculpt workspace. We will also look at assembling our model using joints and as-built joints and other aspects of Fusion 360. So let's get started. You will see that I am at the vdci.edu website and I can either go to Courses, Fusion 360, or scroll down and select Fusion 360. When I click Fusion 360, I will be taken to this page. This page describes our workshops, and you will need to enter your email here to join the workshops. Go ahead and hit Join the Workshops, and this will take you to the Fusion 360 Workshops page. I will scroll down and find Fusion 360 Design 1 Basic Modeling, and I will hit Access Free Workshop Materials. You will go to the workshop page, and here you will see a video which can help you create your Autodesk account and download Fusion 360, or if you scroll down, you will see the data sets and the videos. I will hit download to download my data sets, and you will see your download appear in the lower left corner of your screen. I will go to my downloads folder and right click extract all to extract my files. I'll hit extract. and we can see our extracted files here. I will close these windows and go to Fusion 360. Let's open up our data panel and create our project in Fusion 360. I will go New Project, and I will name this Fusion 101 Basic Modeling, and hit Enter. Go ahead and double-click that project to go into your project. We can now hit Upload to upload our files into our project. I will go select Files, navigate to my Downloads folder, and select Fusion 101. I will select all of my files and hit Open, and then hit Upload. In this project, we have multiple steps which we will go through when assembling our lamp, and there are a few files labeled import which we will use later in this project. The steps that we will use in this project are in chronological order, and the videos will correspond with the steps. You may use your own file throughout the completion of this workshop, or go from step to step to make sure that you have your file exactly as it is in the videos. When our uploads are complete, you can go ahead and hit close on this window, you can see in our data panel on the left side of the screen, all of our files have been imported. And as I scroll down, all of the thumbnails will also update. In the next video, we will set up our preferences and begin modeling. I will see you in the next video.